What's going on people, it's your boy G Valentino, you know what time it is, we're here, Doha West Bay, we've been invited to a question and answer session with some of the athletes who are taking part in the Doha Diamond League. Guys, I'm joined by Karen Clement, 400 meters, hurdles, that's his event. Let me ask him some questions. He's in Doha for the Diamond League. Yes. What's the highlight of your career so far? Yeah. Oh, that'd be kind of easy. Yeah. Winning the Olympic yeah. gold um, in Rio um, in 2016. 2016. Because you, you, athlete, you work in your entire career. Yeah, yeah. And getting that gold medal um, so solidifies everything. Wow. And where's that gold medal right now? It's at home in my trophy home. case, <laughs> along with my other medals. So how do you still stay motivated after all of these years? That's really funny because I was talking to someone about the same thing. It's like me, I got to surround myself with other at least other um, competitors um, and they motivate me because I'm always around the, the college, university, younger guys. Okay. I think they motivate me to keep going because okay. I'm the older guy in the group. Right. So it's like being around them and see how hungry they are and their drive reminds me of what I had back then. I love coming to Doha. Doha is a, is, is a fun city. Um, I came here last year um, for the first time and I went out to the city. I went to the sand dunes and nice. I took some amazing pictures. My friend, um, he lives here, so um, okay. he took me out and um, had a lot of fun. And um, the town here, that the guy, 400 million hurdler guy um, who lives here, um, he's a great talent, yeah. uh, up and coming, so he has a bright future. Okay. Listen, Karen, thank you for your time, man. Thank you. Listen, it's a pleasure <laughs> meeting you, bro. Yes. And uh, I'm sure these guys are going to be watching you and watching you in the Diamond League, man. Yes, yes. yes.